I Chat personally Ditto. think that the Aegis Ditto is pretty fun to watch, just because, uh... I think it's just gonna be a lot of just, like, Mithra aerials, yeah. and it's just... I don't know how to come you know, what... They're, they will both be throwing out there really safe, really fast. Yeah. So Sharp off to a small lead right now. Yeah. I tie, Yeah, Sharp is arrow. Okay. Yes. yes. I need to make sure, like, which one is which. Ooh, that uppy, no, gonna get intercepted by the platform a lot. Tyler to get out a bit faster than Sharp. Still gonna take his first damage right now, but only 4% and... Yeah. Now, is honestly no biggie, as the kids say. Personally, I have never seen the Sharp Aegis. No I, I know biggie. Tyler obviously so, means his character he plays a bunch, but this is his main. I have seen the Sharp Aegis. You have seen the Sharp Aegis? In Squad Strike at Meter Management. Squad Strike? Alright, so against this is Tyler. Tyler. Oh. You know what? If that's the case, then th this has to be coming from that or something. Yeah, ooh, great tech, by the way. Huge awareness. Tyler plays a character, so he knows that that down tilt will sometimes send you into a situation where you have to tech, and he's going to hit the tech, but he's going to miss that up there and eat that nair from Sharp for it, so... Yeah, and Sharp is going to do the first one here. Taking first, first blood. Yeah, okay. nice. Yes. Alright, that was annoying. <laughs> yeah, sorry. We, uh... Alright, we're good. We're back. Anyway. Both of them still playing around here, but again, having this guard situation, going to have a small trade there. But again, just... Sharp just has this lead. Really hard F smash on another. Neither of them going to connect, though. It's sharp, ooh, that would be not too framing, but I believe catching Tyler either dropping off ledge or jump. I think it was the drop judging on the hitbox that yes, showed up Yes, I there. agree, I agree. If he did jump, it would have been a strong hitbox I think that would have hit. Well, I think it might have caught, like, the frame one or two of the jump, which would use, like, the same position as the drop. Yeah, but one honestly, of the two. It doesn't really yeah, matter. One of the two, Sharp converted it into the stock, and now he's up uh, two stocks to one. Yeah, Tyler finally getting stock there. And maybe Tyler can- <laughs> Oh! Hive mind. Hive mind, yeah, I mean... The character is relatively slow charty in terms of like what your openings are, what moves that you're trying to throw out to find those openings. Yeah. I mean, like you're obviously no character can just flow chart neutral and win. Yo. But uh, honestly, wow, Sharp looking very very good here again. Oh, no chance on that one from Tyler. But the side B will bring him back to stage. Matt down down air up smash gonna send Tyler up and dash attack. Not, not gonna, gonna finish the it. job yet. At 100, I'm a little surprised that he's really strong. That uh, yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I mean, that side B. Yeah, so punchable. Especially punchful. if you have one of those big spikes. Yeah, yeah. Like, I, I was gonna say, I like, like, I'm sore. Yeah, you have that perfect. So free. Perfect. And Pyro like, Down Air is. Pyro Down Air is an obvious one. And I'm saying, like, I play Mewtwo. Like, I'm supposed to be doing that with, like, Down with down Air. And it's just, like, it's so small that you have to be so careful. Like, it's it's absolutely ridiculous. But. He just having none of those issues whatsoever. Going back because, to uh, going your back. sword is massive. Yeah. Going to small battlefield and, and, and sticking with the ditto. Yeah, the ditto. I mean, hey, the ditto worked out. Worked if out. anything, I would be curious to see maybe Tyler swaps if he loses game two. Also, Sharp rocking the uh, red hair for Autumn, I believe. And if I do say so myself, looking quite good with it. You're a fan of the red hair? I am a fan of the red hair, okay. I'm a big fan of the red hair. Honestly, I think dyed hair is something more people should experiment with. Yeah. I mean, my brother's done it a few times. He has a... Huh? Yeah. My brother did, um... He dyed his hair pink the first time. Oh, yeah. For, uh... uh Breast cancer? No, a uh, UG... Wait, is it UG? Oh, UG um, from, uh, Jujutsu Kaisen. Yeah, for JJK cosplay for oh, Sakuma. Oh, wow. That's cool. And it was, it was actually really, really cool. I like that. Now he just uh, bleached his hair right now, I've so got, it's like frosted tips and stuff. I personally, I've got the perfect hair to cosplay Aaron, but uh, Aaron doesn't have a beard, so I'd have to shave if I wanted to do that. Yeah, and I'm you also, like your beard. Uh, I'm what? probably going to shave it soon. Or like, not fully shave it, but it definitely needs a trim. It's kind of out of control right now. But what else is out of control? Absolutely is, uh, nothing. Needs. This game is pretty even right yeah, now. Yeah, it's uh, neither of these players. But Sharp getting air, okay. and Tyler getting that down air upbeat, but still not going to kill. And Tyler the one with the lead going into the... Uh, Ladder part of first stock and gonna catching that last hit of the up smash. Shield poke, I believe. Might have been shield poke. And that side be gonna catch sharp a little bit, give Tyler just this nice piece of extra credit. And I will say we have three Aegises in the top four, which is very funny. Uh, DM, Sharp, and Tyler. That's true. Or not the top I, four, but really, the, the winners. Yeah, the winners it, it's really hard to count Sharp out. I'm like, obviously he's playing this, but this is the first time we've seen him today. So it's very, it's kind of, obviously right now we do have three though. But I will say that Tyler is doing much, much better in this game. Three stocks to one right now. Yeah. And that down tilt, not going to be able to be converted. 
not gonna get that slingshot. He was a bit too high percent. And ooh, great, beautiful foresight. Yeah, great foresight on that nair. Not gonna get a ton off him. Sharp will take the shot, but it's kind of a reverse positions of how it was last game, two to one. But uh, Sharp is down this time. Yeah, you have to be so so careful in these situations. Pick your advantage. I think this was dead. It was not fully dead, but yeah, yeah the forward smash. That would probably no, it will not. Ah, on that, wow, yeah. that was good awareness by Tyler not to go to Pyro. Yeah. But still, really, really good in terms of Tyler's advantage and just pushing these ledge traps so, so well. Oh, but Sharp finding a few hits finally finds the few down air conversions at low percent. Going for that, uh, d those down tilts, and he can F smash that. Yeah. Why didn't he F smash that? I don't think he was aware. I think he thought it made him a That thing is stuff. so unsafe on shields. Charizard can F smash. Yeah. Ooh, great, uh, great awareness by Tyler to jump immediately so the down tilt doesn't hit him. Oh, great awareness the, by Sharp. The up smash is Tyler has been loving this move. Gonna be maybe a little stale right Or the up rather. The, the up And that back there they're connected. Sharp is not out of this game. Yeah. Interesting choice going for the back air, back door trying to maybe go for some sort of tech chase. Tech chase or just putting Sharp in a position where he's forced to make a decision because of how far that back door sends. So it's like if Tyler gets the correct guess, Get. The correct yeah. guess, he can uh, get the kill off. Yeah, and Tyler just holding center stage, using those big aerials to try and Ooh, great way Sharp from doing things. Goes for the back throw again, this time sending towards the ledge. And just trying to find the one hit that Tyler needs. It's going to be the weak hit in there, so it won't do it just yet. Don't let him do it to you. A few F-Lets coming out, that shield is looking mighty small, finds a down air. Yeah, 193. But if Sharp gets Tyler off stage. With this combo? Ooh, that grab, grab. Not gonna do it just yet. Great avoidance of that uh, Providence Revolt. Yeah. And you can kinda stay as Mithra here if you want the speed. However, it is gonna be a swap to Pyro. Yeah, Jab will kill, as we saw in the DM set. Yeah. Great timing mix up by Tyler. Tyler finds an F tilt. Just throwing out Tyler those will do it. And we will see. Tyler. Not Tyler. Uh, Shark is definitely bring it back more. In the, in the later half of the game. I'm curious to see what's going to come out from either of them, though, in this game number three. So it's been a lot of back and forth. It's been a little awkward, but yeah. Anyway, in top eight, we already have one set done that was on the side stream, I believe, in Apple Viewer 3 on Deku Raw. And we are continuing with the Aegis today. Apple Viewer will go on to fight the loser of this match that is happening on stream, though. Going to town here. I don't disagree with this stage pick. No. Third stage in three games. You love to see it. Yeah, much, much different than the previous set here. Confident. Either way, it's going to be Tyler with a few of these first hits, keeping Sharp in disadvantage. Also, I believe this is going to be my last set commentating. Uh, I am getting a little bit of a headache. Yeah. All good. And uh, we have Tyler in the lead yet again. Hashtag. Only off to a slight lead though, both of them not getting too many big and decisive hits. Okay. However, Sharp has already swapped to the Pyro, which is very interesting. In a few hits there. And just not able to find anything too decisive this first and soft in game number three. Yeah, just running back and forth. Sharp in advantage now, but Tyler gonna reversal with that there really quick. Very good decision by him. And that's just the story of this game, right? If they're both as mythory, they can both kind of reverse each other pretty easily with Ooh, and uh, Tyler hard, but... messing up on his uh, recovery, allowing himself to get F tilted by Sharp. That F tilt didn't kill straight up, but he knew no matter what he did, Sharp would get the punish, so he just decided to execute. And all of a sudden, Sharp in the lead. Yeah. I mean, that's just what happens in this matchup, right? It's so volatile. It just really depends on who gets their hits first. Yes. See, now Tyler's got... Oh. With the platform moving, I thought we were going to get a rapid jab chain off the side. I was, I was like, expecting was so the uh, neutral beat from Mithra, but... One of the two. Yeah. We do not end up getting either, and... Oh, wow, beautiful edge guard, just, Yeah. Take Tyler's stock right down in there. stunning. Really, really good. Trying to go for broke with that F smash. And he there. doesn't even die for it, which no. is shocking. Yeah. F smash, not gonna kill on time. Sharp time is so well. Finally gonna lose their first stock, but suddenly we're in it, the same position we were in in game number one, where uh, Sharp having two stocks, Tyler's one, and looking very, very dominant. Doesn't need that up. He is six seventy four percent. 
And if Tyler wants to win this game, he's got to make a come busy, as the kids say. Is that what they say? Call it now. Uh, yes. <laughs> I oh. can confirm. Interesting. There goes to the down air is a mid throw, but again, 120 percent on Tyler on the very back foot. The down air is going to come in, but the air dodge on the, the air dodge and gets it. Tyler is going to go down to the one in the set. And I just heard Sharp's bands, which are Smashville, Hollow, and Small Matter. I can believe that. That makes sense. I mean, it's the ditto, so it's just pure pressure. Going to battlefield. Uh, but yeah, sharp back to form that we were seeing in that game number one, having such a strong advantage off that original reversal of that first stop. And you can just see the color. Like this is someone who has performed exceptionally at majors. Someone who is no stranger to being on top and being on the and We are seeing it right now. So where the pool um is uh, been consistently ranked top five in the island, and and for good reason. We're seeing yeah. it here. We do not see them going down from that anytime soon. And we will say fourth stage in four games. Nice. That, uh, Uppy will connect. Both of them playing around each other once again, just getting a few small hits on each of them. It's gonna be Tyler is the one in advantage this time. Indeed. This is how the last game started, though, and you saw how that went. Good switch to the Pyro to our recover. And right back to Mithra. Good grab. Back and forth, finds a back air. Not too much else, though. Yeah, that landing grab by Tyler took advantage of a little bit of Sharp's hesitation. I think he wanted to react to an option, but Tyler said, I'll give you something unreactable. Yeah. And Tyler, once again, in a big lead here, but as we saw, there can be a big reversal. A few dash attacks and suddenly at the ledge. Oh, and not going to be able to get the final hit of that up. Be good. Probably maybe SDI from Sharp, but maybe the positioning was just weird. Yeah, I Sometimes you just don't know with this game. But oh my god, tried to go for broke with yeah. the up B. I'm getting a little uh, surprised he didn't just go for the, co the consistent punch of just like forward air, get him in disadvantage, I get was thinking stage. the same. I don't know if that forward air would have killed. I actually very much doubt it would have. Yeah, I don't think it would have killed, but it would have done more sense. That's but it was a little too low. It did not He was, he was pretty high percent, so that's not going to hurt him insanely that much in the long run. But honestly, every stop that you can keep against a player like Sharp is a stop that you are going to want to keep. However, Tyler continuing to push disadvantage on the second stop here. Looks like that's not throwing him out too much. Like you said, it was a higher percent. You kind of shake that off pretty easily. And it's being shaken off very easily here already. 66% put onto Sharp from Tyler. Going for that S-Mash. Sharp and Tyler both have been going for a lot of those. Very, very hard to punish, but none of them have really been hitting so far. Ooh, interesting side beat there. Not going to be able to find the punish. However, Tyler finds a quick little down tilt into up to air. Finds a rapid jab on the platform. And we're back Sharp, in this Sharp opting to go for the Pyro for the recovery and opting to stay Pyro too, actually. But I lied, they just swapped. Pyro on the Pyro, Sharp on the Mithra. Yeah. And the dynamic between the Pyro and the Mithra in this matchup is really what you're gonna have. Like, how good are you at fighting Mithra with Pyro? Because obviously you're at a disadvantage. Mm -hmm. But you can get those, like, low percent kills. Which is what Sharp is going for right now with that down air. Sharp still in disadvantage here, however, that is going to be very, very risky, especially with Max Rage on Sharp. That is going to say he's something very, very far. Finds the back air there, and now Tyler is the one in disadvantage at the ledge. What's the punch going to be? It's not going to be anything, though. Both them trying to find the opening. Both men both on Pyra now. Indeed. <laughs> and that jab, and he will do it. We saw that in the DM set. And 160% that would definitely take the stock. Absolutely. But, honestly, not too big of a deficit. Tyler going for it all with that there. I think it, that just straight up kills if he gets, connects it. But I mean, honestly, I would too. If if you can just end the game there, don't have to adapt. Don't have to think about like more habits or reads that you're saving. Just short and sweet. However, it's not gonna end up like that. But Sharp is taking 63 damage so far. Yeah, you were really close. Ooh, interesting. Air dodge not gonna be able to get punished for it though. Yeah. Finds it down there on the platform. Is he gonna be able to convert? The stock is not. The up there isn't gonna take it just yet. Tries to find another one on these platforms, but isn't able to find anything just yet as Tyler continues to push his advantage. And rack up this damage. 86, 91. 
Ooh, great uh, foresight. foresight there, but will it be too little too late? Stock still not having taken. What's it going to be? The punish on the side any of the st- Any stock that an Aegis still has is a stock that can win the game. This Absolutely. character is bonkers in advantage. However, Tyler has just not been able to find... Not Tyler. Sharp has just not been able to find the hit as Tyler continues to find these uh, smaller hits. And that back air! And that will be a solid We are going to game number five for the second set in a row. Indubitably. Absolutely. Insane. Game number What's five. The other stream? Unleashed and Just Blue, I believe? Yes, yes it is. Very, very nice. Uh, I will say... Uh... Are we going to see five stages in five games? That is the question. Also, are we going to see Sharp stay on the Aegis? This is another question, because uh, Tyler is going great <laughs> right to that Aegis. But Sharp couldn't really get much started that last step to last game. And yeah, it's okay, like honestly, I think the Joker might be the Go have a drink. Oh my god, please go get food. I'll see you tomorrow. Right, bye. Who's that? My brother. Oh, wow. I didn't know he lived around here. Uh, he goes to Northeastern. Makes sense. Yeah. And we're back to the Aegis Ditto with the fifth stage oh my five god. Five stages, five games. You know what? We love to see it. We do. I have no complaints. However, so there has been no character diversity in this matchup. It is 100% Aegis. Yeah, I know. The one set where we have all the stage diversity is like the character diversity in the stage. It plays almost the exact same way. Yeah, and we see Sharp off to a uh, swift start, 40%, 43 And this is what uh, Sharp really wants to see here. He just doesn't want to get put in the Tyler Vortex. They really have just been trading games back and forth and trading how... Which one of them is in more advantage of the beginning of the game? I'll say, which one of them wants it more is really good. It's going to determine the set, I think. And there's quite a lot of money on the line as well. Yes, indeed. Three dollars. I don't think it's three At least. At least three Probably more. Definitely more. I mean, you've seen the prize pop for this tournament. Yeah, it's exactly. Three dollars. At least. Allegedly. Allegedly. Nah, for real though, we've got a uh, meaty pot bonus out here, as well as the, uh, yeah. all of the entry fee going to the Dude, the joke is, is that the pot bonus isn't even, like, that big compared to the prize itself. Yeah, exactly. And that was the one that supplied the pot bonus. <laughs> Good for you. Absolutely insane. No, uh, honestly, if we want to thank it, I'm going to do a shout-out quickly here. Shout-out to Cass and Ashla at Mash Harder 7, because I hope they're by providing a side stream. Yeah. And we didn't talk about, like, payment or anything for that at all during it. And after I left, they paid me for it. And Such I was awesome, like, by the way. Thank you very much. And they paid me, and I was like, I did not realize I was getting paid, like I was going to do it, whatever. So I kind of made the decision there, because I knew this tournament was happening. Yeah. Um, it wasn't announced yet, but I knew it was happening. And I was like, you know what, I'm just going to do it. Honestly, Put that it is, back in the seat. That is very, very admirable of you. And, ooh, now they're not going to connect, but, uh... Also, I'm important. So yeah, I exactly. I can, I can afford Supporting the scene, T.O. supporting T.O.'s, everyone in Boston, yeah. just... Making sure each other can do everything. That's what it's all about. Yeah. Fucking love everyone here. No, we really... I mean, we have an amazing scene in here. And what else was amazing? Uh, that was insane. Uh, yeah, so... I'm not gonna honestly question that. Um, Alright. Moving on from whatever was just posted in Twitch chat. Yeah. We've got a shark here off the stock. 82% in that F-Smash, I believe, first or second one of the set connecting. Yeah, that's dead. There's a few guys. Yeah, there have been two edge guards from both of them. Yeah. I, mean, we're talk, I was making the other thing before, while the other edge guard was happening. There was a really good edge guard on Sharp's sharp side. And now Tyler firing right back with it. And we are now game five, the last stock, Aegis Ditto. Yeah. Who wants it more? Who's going to find those small hits? It's going to be Tyler finding a few of them. Holding center stage, both of them just vying for position, trying to be so careful to find the opening. Neither of them finding it yet, just playing around each other, playing out some of these moves. And it's going to be Charles 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 finding the over. first hits. Air dodging through, down tilt, up tilt. Oh, but no grab on the neutral air. It's going to be facing the other way. Alright, alright, please. Yeah, and um. Um, this is a hence, hence game five here. Down air, up smash, and that's and gonna that be Tyler be taking the set. Three, two. Oh, <laughs> all right. I'm gonna 